keeps taking all the nostalgia magazines. Well, good morning, Charlotte. Hello, Abby. How are you? I'm good. Say, aren't you a little early for your appointment? Yeah, but I have some reading to catch up on. My name is George Hertel, and I was born in Seattle. I became part of the history of the Spokane area when I met a tall brunette at a dance in Gig Harbor at the Scandia Gord. Her name was Sally Landis, and she told me that Spokane was sunny and that she had a place to live out at Newman Lake. It rains a bit in Seattle, and the farmers would often bring their honey wagons into the shop for pinion fields. These were big dump trucks used for manure that needed work under the bed. On rainy days, these trucks leaked big time, and mostly on me while working under them. We decided that I would go to school one summer with Sally. She said I smelled better. <laughs> Sally lived in Spokane most of her life. She was born at home, had her tonsils out on the dining room table, a true depression baby. Her mother and grandmother raised her, a single parent home before it was stylish. Yet she never realized her family was poor. We got married in 1960 at Mission Avenue Presbyterian Church, where we made lifelong friends with the Arcos, Beatties, Schwartzes, and many others. I graduated from Eastern Washington State College in 1964 and began my teaching career. I taught at Sacagawea, Gary, and Brown. Sally was also a teacher at Wilson, Balboa, Finch, and then Whitman. At home, we were having fun raising our two little girls, Lisa and Melanie. They loved dancing and camping and they really loved playing in the deep snow during the winter of 1967. In 1971, Sally had breast cancer. After two surgeries, she became a truly topless dancer. We decided to have another child and we chose to adopt a baby boy, Garen Timothy. Sally called him her little guarantee. In Spokane, we had a great place to live with lots of interesting people, places to go with friends, and plenty of time to sort out the pictures we have in box. I see you in my dreams, hold you in my dreams. Someone took you out of my arms, still I feel the thrill of your charm. That once were mine Tender eyes that shine Sally and I celebrated 45 years of marriage. She was the love of my life. Stay tonight, light my way tonight I see you in my dreams The doctor will see you now, Charlotte. Okay. I'm ready. Nostalgia Magazine is the most consistently stolen magazine from waiting rooms around the inland northwest. Subscribe today by calling 509-443-3678 or online at nostalgiamagazine.net. Nostalgia Magazine. Ageless stories. Ageless photos. Lips that once were mine Tender eyes that shine Stay tonight, light my way tonight I'll see you in my dreams Stay tonight, light my way tonight I'll see you 